Good morning, fifth graders. This is Ms. Nusky. I will be your math teacher this year in fifth grade. Um, I just wanted to get on really quickly and explain to you one of your assignments that's going to be on Tuesday, September 1st. Um, and it is your virtual locker decorating. So I'm going to share my screen with you and I want to um, just explain to you how you would enter photos, okay? And so this is going to make a little bit more sense once you can see it. Okay, so you will get on your assignments and you will see this, okay? So it says design your own virtual locker and they give you some ideas that you can put in your locker. So it says design your virtual locker to help me get to know you better. Include at least 10, so 10 or more, things that to, to get us to get to know each other and to tell us more about who you are. So consider including some of the following. Pictures of your family, friends, pets, your favorite book or books, your favorite movies, your favorite TV shows, your favorite music, what you'd like to do for fun, a future goal you might have, your favorite sport or team, your favorite food, your favorite subject to learn about, a hobby you enjoy, a college you're interested in attending someday, a place you'd like to visit, something you did over the summer, and be creative. So if it's not on the list and it's something that like you might, let's say video game or something like that, um, that's not on the list, absolutely put a picture of that in there and you can tell us about it, okay? So on the second slide, you will see directions that say, Type a summary of your virtual locker here. Your summary should include each item added into your locker and a brief, just maybe one or two sentences on each thing that you chose and why you chose it. Okay, so the first slide is just exactly what I'm going to be explaining to you. So if you watch this video, you don't really need to read this first slide. Okay, so let's go back to your locker. I'm gonna show you two different ways that you can insert your pictures to explain yourself and explain about who you are. So you're going to go to insert here on the top Okay, and then you're gonna hover, you're not going to click, you're just gonna hover over image. And there's two different ways you're gonna do this. You can either upload it from your computer or you can search from the web. Okay, so if you already have a picture saved on your home computer or eventually saved on your own iPad, you can click upload from your computer, okay? And for the sake of just showing you, I'm gonna show you my cat, one of my only pet, her name is Prim. So I would click on Prim and I'll click open. And Prim becomes really large, right? So we want to shrink Prim down so she fits in the locker, okay? And she's still kind of too big, so we can shrink her some more, okay? Maybe even a little bit more if you want. And I'll stick her on top of my locker, okay? And that's it. So that's only if you have your picture already saved, okay? The other way is to go to insert, click it, insert, hover over image, and then search the web. So click on search the web. And you will see that I already had actually typed in, it says kitten transparent background. Okay, so let me do a different one to show you. So let's say you have a dog, let's say puppy, but you want to type, you have to type in transparent background because if you don't, it's going to come with, it won't look the right way. So puppy transparent background and a bunch of different puppies come up. Now you might not have this type of puppy. Um, so you might wanna type in golden retriever. Wow, that's my favorite dog. Golden retriever, transparent, okay? So then your specific dog might come up, okay? And look how cute he is. So I'm gonna just click on him and click insert. And now the puppy comes up. Now again, really large image. So you're gonna to wanna to shrink them down. Okay, shrink, shrink, shrink. Because you want at least 10 pictures describing yourself, okay? So this might be my one thing that I talk about my pet. All right. And you can even make them smaller because you wanna fit 10 in there, okay? So that's just one example, okay, of your pet. Now, your favorite book, your favorite movie, you can get creative with it, okay? But I just want to show you the two different ways. Again, insert image, and then either upload it from your computer, which is already saved, or just search the web, okay? All right, so now I'm going to stop sharing my screen. 
And if you have any questions about um, your virtual locker or how to insert the pictures and you need some one-on-one -on -one help, just reach out to me and I will gladly help you. I can't wait to see your lockers and get to know about more who you are. And I'm going to be working on my virtual locker so that you can learn about a little bit more about who I am. Okay. All right. I will see you guys soon. Bye.